today we have some more awesome updates from Freepick. And with all these constant non-stop updates, it's like Christmas every week. And like most updates, I'll also have an amazing prompt generator to share. Now instantly, ChatGPT is just going to go ahead and give you 10 unique and creative color palettes. And it will actually pair up with this update perfectly. In fact, I'll share two updates and two prompt generators. Now the first update is one of my new favorite ones. Veo2 now has a new addition in Freepick. You can now now use image to AI video. But let's first start with this prompt generator. And then from there, we'll move on to the second update. And so to start, we're gonna go ahead and visit my prompt generators database. It is nothing but prompt generators or prompts that generate prompts. We are gonna go ahead and open up this one right here. It's called image to video prompt generator. And here it is right here. Go ahead and copy and paste the whole entire thing. As a quick reminder, remember any prompt, including this one that I share in my YouTube videos will always be available 100% free to use for anybody. Just click the links in the description. So now with this whole entire prompt copied, what we want to do is come over here and head into any LLM. For this one, I'll be using ChatGPT. Now, in order to use this prompt generator the right way, the AI you choose needs to have the capacity to assess and inspect any sort of uploaded photos. And that's exactly what we're about to do. Now, this whole entire prompt basically says, I want you to inspect my image and then provide me with an AI image to AI video prompt to use in AI video tools. Okay, so now the first thing you wanna do is paste the prompt in to ChatGPT just like this, or any LLM. Now, after you submit the prompt, the first thing ChatGPT is gonna say is this. Got it. Please upload an image and I'll generate three high quality AI video prompts tailored to its style, subject, and setting. And I just simply click and drag this image right here of this astronaut. Once you click and drag that image in there, right away it appears right here in ChatGPT, and then instantly I analyze the image and here are three high quality AI video prompts based on the image. Scroll down, look at this right here, lunar walk. We're gonna get an FPV astronaut and now we're gonna get sci-fi moon landing. So you can use any of these prompts in conjunction with your images, but what's important to keep in mind is just go ahead and inspect a prompt and then also look at your image you uploaded. Just choose the one that's gonna be most relevant to the actual image. And I'll go ahead and copy everything, including the camera movements, but I won't choose the mood or the lighting. Now with this copied, now let's go ahead and head over here into free pick. Now with that said, make sure you have Veo2 opened up and now you can see we have a start image that we can use. Simply select this and go ahead and bring our photo in. And now there we have it. As it's uploading, there it is right there. But notice this, instead of using the prompt it just gave us, I'm going to go ahead and remove this. And now this time, I'm going to go ahead and paste in the prompt that I got from my prompt generator. Just like that, let's go ahead and change it to 8 seconds instead, 16-9 aspect ratio. Now, let's go ahead and generate this. And you can see, it's only going to take 2.5 minutes. That is very good. But while this is generating, let's go ahead and take a look at update number 2, including this amazing prompt generator I want to show you specifically for this update as well. Now, for this update, we're going to head back over into images. For our mode, we're going to select ideogram, just like that. Now, the update here is going to be colors. You can now utilize color palettes. Look at all of these color palettes that we're going to get. Now, you can generate your images with a specific color palette, including your own colors. If I go to my colors, you could see that I actually uploaded my own personal color palette for Metrics Mule. Now, we're going to generate an image. But first, let me show you this amazing prompt generator for this one. Now, this one, if you do have access to this database, it will be under the AI images section, okay? And you can see it right here. Let me go ahead and click to expand this. This is gonna be an AI images color palette a color palette creator. Come in here and copy this whole entire thing, just like that. Open up a brand new chat, and now simply paste this in. Now instantly, ChatGPT is just gonna go ahead and give you 10 unique and creative color palettes, just like this. Look at this. We're gonna get all these different color palettes and then a prompt example to go with it. This is fantastic, because what we're gonna do is utilize a prompt, and then also we can reference the actual color palette. So what we're gonna do is, with this in mind, we can do one of two things. I can come in here and just simply copy the prompt like this, go ahead and paste it in the free pick. And now since I can do a comparison, I could just look at a specific color palette I wanna use, or I could take these color palettes just like this, copy them, and then head back over into free pick and actually select new colors myself. Go back to ChatGPT 
and copy these specific color palettes like this. If you want to use this one, copy the whole entire thing down here at the bottom, paste it in. Okay. There it is. Molten orange all the way to plasma pink. Now, the next thing you want to do is say this, please provide me with the hex codes for each color. Now watch this. Now it's going to look at this specific color and now look at this automatically. Look amazing. It's going to give you the hex codes for the solar inferno color palette. Copy that hex code back in the free pick. I'm going to go ahead and paste it over here on the right hand side. And now there's that orange one. Beautiful. Back over here and just go ahead and repeat the process for each of the hex codes. Now, right here, I have four of them added in here. Now, just simply select save color. Now I have my solar inferno one right here. Beautiful. Now notice my prompt is already in over here on the left hand side. I selected this color palette with ideogram selected. Let's go ahead and generate multiple images just to make sure we get exactly what we're looking for. Now, while these are thinking, notice right below, here is the video we just made. Okay. Let's go ahead and open this up. And right off the bat, I could tell you this is going to look great. Look at that. Wow. Amazing job that this did again, using the prompt for my prompt generator and in conjunction with the actual image for image to video. Now let's X this out. It looks like our images are done with the color palette. Look at how great this actually looks. It maintained everything I was looking for, kept my color palette, and I got a great looking image. Now, one more thing to keep in mind. Let's go ahead and just do one last thing because I really want to show you how good of a job this can do. If I go to my mega prompts database and I come back here over into free pick. So here is one with ideogram right here, which ideogram has done a great job with text. So this was done in ideogram. Let's copy this whole entire prompt like this. Let's see if we can get the same thing generated, but this time use a completely different style of color palette. We're going to go with neon night. Okay. Very different. Now let's go ahead and now generate two of these images. Here is the first one. Great job with the color palette. And most importantly, it got the spelling accurate, but yet the other ones are done and look how good these turned out spelling accurate yet again. Okay. Wow. Now look at this one. I love the way this one turned out. In fact, all four of these actually turned out fairly well. So there you have it. Another amazing update by free pick. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And remember, if you like this video, please hit that subscribe button. But thank you so much for watching.